the Great White Brotherhood, Master Kuan Yin. When the Divine Feminine is restored give peace a chance it is with the grace of the Goddess and Divine Mother that I, Lady Kuan Yin, greet you. I now stand as a representative of the purest vibrations of sacred feminine aspects, qualities, and expressions of the Creator so that you may absorb and activate the same within your being. Let us welcome the purest vibrations of the Divine Feminine aspects of the Creator into our current ascension, knowing that acceptance will lead to synthesis within your being and the universe of the Creator. On the inner planes, I, Lady Kuan Yin, am communing in unison, uniting energies with a focus to synthesize the aspects of the Divine Feminine that we represent to create a powerful unified wave of Goddess vibrations and power that will impact and alter the Earth and the Inner Planes. I, Lady Kuan Yin, always focus on unity and synthesis between our energies, for I know that Mother Mary represents an aspect of the energies of the Divine Mother. I represent Kuan Yin, a different aspect. When these two aspects are united, I am able to recognize the footless vibrations of the Goddess. Mother Mary has been known on Earth as a Western figure of the Divine Mother, while I, Kuan Yin, have been known to represent the Eastern figure. Many may perceive Mother Mary's energies and mine to be the same. Both hold a powerful resonance and embody the Divine Mother. Some may even recognize her as the same soul. However, we are two souls representing two aspects of the Mother's vibrations, the Divine and the Sacred Feminine. Synthesizing the energies of the Divine Mother is the purpose of unlocking the divinity and power of the Creator, bringing empowerment to all aspects of the Divine Feminine, whether on the Earth or the Inner Plains. When the Divine Feminine is restored and empowered, this will allow for sustained and enhanced vibration of the Divine Masculine. So the Divine Feminine and Divine Masculine will become equal in vibration, encouraging a full and complete blending where the old concept of the Divine Feminine and Divine Male will be dissolved. The two will become a unified vibration of the Creator, where aspects are no longer recognized as separate identities, Take a moment to imagine how this would impact the Earth on the inner and outer planes, giving your perspective greater importance. You may wish to visit us on the inner planes to experience and absorb the powerful waves of synthesized Divine Mother energy that we are creating. You might want to use this invocation, Beloved Mother Mary and Lady Kuan Yin, I appeal for your energy, love, protection, and support. Please direct my consciousness to the chamber in which you reside on the inner planes within the eleventh ray of light Gosham at the planetary level. It is my desire to sit with you as you synthesize your own soul energies and the divine feminine energies also known as the Divine Mother and Goddess Vibrations. It is my desire to absorb the synthesized energies that you are creating to empower the Divine Feminine aspect of my soul, thereby anchoring the energies that you create and that I receive into the Earth to benefit and support all of humanity in accepting this powerful wave of light and synthesis with the Creator that you are creating now. I am ready and available to receive the beautiful blessings that you are creating, and I am ready and available to support the outpouring of these beautiful blessings throughout the entire world and universe of the Creator. Simply take a deep breath, imagine, feel, or recognize yourself with us.
Mother Mary and I Kuan Yin, observing and receiving your energy creation. Breathe the energy deeply into your entire being and body, noticing the changes and healing that take place. We are synthesizing two aspects of the Divine Feminine to raise the energy vibration throughout the Earth and Inner Planes. We are achieving this now because the process of synthesis is so profoundly important at this stage of ascension. The unified energy we are creating will actually create a healing space for the deep synthesis of all forms and aspects of the Creator to take place within your being. This is a powerful concept and idea that will bring about immense healing and a deeper sense of resonance and familiarity with the Creator. It is our wish that you take a moment to contemplate the extreme energies of the Creator. For example, love and hate, fear and contentment, joy and sadness, abundance and lack, trust and distrust, certainty and doubt. There are so many extreme energies that exist within your being and are created by your energy throughout your day. The examples we share are more focused on feelings, emotions, perspectives, thoughts, and states of being. However, there are extremes of energy, vibrations, beliefs, experiences, situations, and even souls all around you. There is a need to recognize, honor, and respect these extreme aspects of the Creator, as all were born from the energy of the Creator. Even seemingly negative experiences, energies, or thoughts were created by the Creator's energy, or the Creator's energy was used to fuel your creativity. Take a moment to acknowledge the extremes within and around you, try to contemplate this on countless levels, and even contemplate the physical surroundings of your reality. I don't want you to judge, but simply observe, recognize, and realize. I want you to notice the beauty of the Creator in everything. This is a wonderful practice of acceptance without feeling the need to alter, engage, or influence. The energies that we, Kuan Yin and Mother Mary, are creating support the healing and synthesis of these extremes that you are observing. Our purpose is to bring the vibration of balance the synthesis of extremes. This does not mean that the extremes will dissolve or be erased. It just means that your perspective of the Creator and all that is the Creator will shift and shift, thus supporting the new focused perspective on unification and synthesis. If your focus is on unity, this is the energy you will create and experience in your reality, as well as recognize within yourself and others. Therefore, you will not react to energies that appear to be extremes in your reality within your being, so you will recognize them as the same, unified in oneness. This has always been the case. It is simply that your perspective has shifted to align with and recognize the truth of the Creator. In meditation or quiet times, we want you to focus on two extremes that influence your reality or are created by you. Perhaps there is a desire for there to be love. But there are people in your reality whom you hate or dislike because they have frustrated or harmed you. It is important to recognize that love and hate are born from the same energy, essentially, they are the same vibration simply expressed in different ways. With your recognition of love and hate being the same vibration and expression of the Creator, we wish you to recognize and accept both love and hate within your being. Imagine that you place both love and hate in your heart chakra. Hate is not negative, 
and love is not beautiful. They are simply two aspects of the Creator that you do not wish to judge, simply accept them. We can invite you to call upon our energies, Kuan Yin and Mother Mary, to envelop you, asking us to send our synthesized Divine Mother Light into your being. When you feel ready, invite your soul's energy of synthesis and unification to the surface and fill your heart bringing healing to the energy, perspective, and past experiences of love and hate. As these two aspects heal within your heart, the energy of synthesis and unification flows in all directions throughout your physical body, auric fields, and surroundings. This energy is actually having an impact on your being and your reality. It is as if the love-hate vibration of energy and perspective of the past is being healed within you and reborn as a new synthesized energy of wholeness and unity with the Creator. This is a process of empowerment and greater unification with the Creator. Take a moment to contemplate all the extremes within your reality. I love the voice. Master Kuan Yin the Star Traveler decrees that, may all humanity live good days, full of love, peace, light, and harmony. May the light be present in all hearts, leading us to the awakening of consciousness for the work of Christ. May humanity live in the light, with the light, and for the light. So be it. Stay in the light. Friends and brothers, I want to thank you all for visiting the Star Traveler page. The contents are messages from the Masters of the Universe for the awakening of consciousness and the construction of a better world. I ask you to please share this page so that you will be participating in the construction of a better world. Do not forget to click on the bell to know about each post on this page as soon as it is published. A lot of light namaste.